And this is a custom stand that we did for Airbus. And I think it's a really good alternative for anybody that's doing maintenance on an AS350. This stand, so it's adjustable. There's also sliders that pop over the aircraft, so there's zero gaps. It's a really good stand for maintenance. It also has a Here, here's all of our sliders which allowed us to contour. Uh, you know, you want to work on your uh, engine, work on your transmission, main rotor head. If you want to get up to the main rotor head, you could raise this platform up to the height. Right, stand out here or stand in the aircraft. So it's a good one, really good option. It also has a handrail system right here. This handrail system. We uh, positioned the stairs on this back here to keep the hangar space tight because they have small bays. It's a very tight system. And this is a great aim for fatigue mat for your back, neck, prevents fatigue. These stairs actually fit as the stair stairs. Specific. But why these things are so uh, important is because they can also be used on other aircraft. You come over here, we have an EC-130. We have an EC-130. We have the same set of platforms. So you can modify the height up and down. So they are a good stand for routine maintenance and they also work really good with the multiple or various aircraft. Uh, if you look under here, You'll see how it fits over the skids. I'm wondering how we did that. We've got them over the skids, and I'll bring you around to the front. See here in the front, what you do is you'll drop this jack down, which then lifts up the stand, and it allows you to get this wheel over the skid. Once it's over the skid, you can take this out and you move it out of the way. Step stool right here. Excellent. Flip this over. Stand back. You flip this up. This is a perfect stand right here to work on the tail roll. It's a good ergonomic stand. You can also pull it around and use it for the engine. Perfect height for the engine. You got some tool trays on it. Handrails. Lightweight. It's uh, aluminum stand. It's not even that heavy. We have one more stand over here. What we're going to go look at now is an EC-145 or an H-145. A little bit different platform, a lot bigger aircraft. This is a double deck stand. So this side pipe right here is going on the engine and transmission uh, engine. There is where you work up on the rotor head. This top deck holds this back up here. This top deck folds out of the way. So you'll pull this pin and this whole deck will fold up, which allows you to use this bottom working deck. So if you want to use this top deck, you just fold it back down. not have sliders because we've already contoured it to the aircraft specific stand. This is a left side stand and there's a right. They come together the form. One of the special features we have about this H145 or EC145 stand is this extra protection right here with the working up on the flight controls. So we have this adjustable hand protection. So, uh, safe at all times. The stands also have an anti fatigue mat. Get down here. So, you're standing on anti fatigue mat all the time. And I mentioned earlier that the deck below that I'm standing on, which is the top deck, actually folds up out of the way. 
so that when you want to work on engine or some lower components on the aircraft that this would be too high and you don't want to bend down, you actually can fold this deck up, go down, walk up the other set of stairs and work from the lower platform and put all of this stuff right here in your ergonomic height so you're not bending down. Safe structure, that's it, and God bless.